I'm gonna be there at the finish line for you. I'm gonna make a big sign for you. He doesn't show up for anything. <laughs> and then he shows up. The new movie, Stronger, is about a man who survived the Boston Marathon bombing, lost both of his legs. That man is Jeff Bauman. Playing him in this new movie is actor Jake Gyllenhaal. They both joined me this morning. Thank you both for being here. We appreciate it. Thank you, Lauren. So, Jeff, you wrote, you, a, you wrote a book about your experience, and you wrote the book. You then have you've now gone through <laughs> the, uh, the filming, the making of this movie. It's got to be tough to relive some of these moments. Yeah, it's a, it, it is really tough, um, but it's also, you know, it's great to see how far I've come looking back on all these, uh, kind of looking back, but it's also like hindsight is twenty twenty. I'm like, oh, I shouldn't have made those choices, but right. um, looking back on your life, just, uh, but it's, it's kind of surreal, and it's, um, you know, it's really amazing just to see the hard work in the film and seeing it all pay off and how good the movie is. I, I'm really honored to be a part of this. Welcome home. Is it good to be back? <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, talking to you. What are you doing? Dancing. Jake, when did you know this was a movie you wanted to be a part of, and, and why was it uh, so special for you? I mean, immediately I read the, the script, and I immediately, I, particularly because I, I was laughing through a lot of the, the, the mm. script when I read it because it's Jeff is so funny just as he is, and he always has such a good nature about him, and he's. Um, always making light of every situation and that's throughout the film and there there are a lot of laughs throughout the movie but there were in the script as well as a lot of tears so I think I saw the photograph of Jeff without you know when when the bombings first happened without ever knowing our lives would you know come together the way they did but um, you know it's a story really about him and his sense of humor and his huge heart that got him through it and I just I knew immediately that mm -hmm. I wanted to be a part of it I saw the premiere of the movie was actually at the Boston Hospital where you did uh, a lot of your rehab, Jeff. And that had to have been such a special moment for you. I, probably a little odd because, well, first of all, you had some of your, your doctors, your therapists who were there with you who, who, who walked the red carpet. But then you, you've got like celebrities hanging out with you as well. It's a good blend, Lauren. It's like, you know, we're all mingling and having fun. And it's good to see that because, you know, the, my caregivers and the, like the PTs and the nurses and mm -hmm. my doctor, they're all in the movie. Wow. And now they get to meet Jake. They're like, they don't even want to meet me. They're like, Jeff, get out of the way. Where's Jake? Yeah. Um, we, also, yeah. we, we also all acted together in the movie. They're in the movie. So yeah, they're in the oh. movie. I knew them from working together. And so we, yeah, I mean, a number of people who actually recovered at Spalding Rehabilitation Center and a lot of people at BMC who helped Jeff in, with his initial uh, recovery. And they, a lot of them are actually in the movie. So I, I knew them before that. So it was this yeah. interesting blend of reality and fiction in this way. And pretty incredible. I, I thought about you the first time he arrived at that rehabilitation center. Did he ever think that there would be a movie about him being made and there would be a premiere there a few years yeah. later? It's, yeah, it's that was Spalding Rehab. It shows him, shows who he is and shows what an inspiration he is to people that, you know, he can come as far as he has. You showed the world that they can't break us no matter what the hell they do. So powerful. We can't wait to see it. Thank you both for joining us. Thank, Thank you, you, Lauren. Lauren. Stronger is going to be in theaters this week, and you can find a link with more details on our website, fox4news.com.